Hi, Gemini, someone rising at Venus. Welcome to my channel. Today I'll be doing your love reading for November 2023. If this does not resonate, you're more than welcome to check your other placements and cross watchers. This could be vice versa. Gemini, we're starting off with your love interests. What are their feelings and actions they plan on taking? And then towards the end, we'll be taking a look at singles. Let's go ahead and get right into it. Thanks, Holy Spirit. What does this person want to tell Gemini? What are their feelings for Gemini at this time? cards. Does this person want to call Gemini? Oh my gosh. All right. Um, okay. <laughs> Gemini, I'm sorry, but I'm kind of laughing because I feel like this person's a little bit dramatic. Okay. They could have said this to you already. Just keep that in mind. They could have already said this to you. Um, or they could be saying this to you or this is what they're telling themselves, but okay So they do want to say I never want to see you again <laughs> You're breaking down these walls. I've built around my heart Maybe you deserve better than me My friends are attracted to you and the karmic knows how I feel about you. So there's definitely a lot going on here um under the deck you do have I've been crying myself to sleep every night let me show you these three so maybe you deserve better than me my friends are attracted to you and the karmic knows how I feel about you I'm getting a very very specific message this person may never want to see you again because seeing you is like a weakness it's like a kryptonite it's like you make this person weak, if you know what I mean, because they have such intense feelings for you. So that's another message that's coming through here for, for you, Gemini. Um, so, you know, this person's friends might think you're like hot or really good looking or just something about you, Gemini. Let's see what's going on here. What is this person's feeling for Gemini? That is just Holy Spirit. Ten of Swords, the Hermit, and the Eight of Wands. Oh, wow. Okay. So there was definitely an ending here. Okay. Um, with the Hermit, you could be connecting with a Virgo, um, Aries, Leo, Sagittarius for some of you. They could have these placements in their chart, but I'm seeing that there was definitely an ending. Tell me about the Eight of Wands before I say anything. And I will say the Three of Swords is under the deck. So there was a third party situation, whether on your end, their end, maybe both of you. Um, tell me about the Eight of Wands for this person's feelings for Gemini. Okay, yeah, there's definitely a third party situation here. Um, you do have the Five of Swords, the Three of Cups, and the eight, um, Queen of Wands. So Queen of Wands a lot of times could mean the other man, the other woman. Um, I will say this person does find you very, very attractive, Gemini. They have a very strong magnetic connection for you, like towards you. Um, a lot did happen between you two. I'm feeling that there could be a five to 10 year age difference between you two. Okay, this could be a twin flame. Um, with the three of cups, I feel like low key, this person desires to talk to you. They desire to reunite with you. But so much has already happened, you know, and it could have been due to another man or another woman. Very straightforward. Yeah, someone could already be like in a whole another family or have like a whole family here. Tell me about the actions. Actions this person plans on taking towards Gemini. Actions this person plans on taking towards Gemini. Well, this person, you know, I will say if they are in another connection, they're really bored. Okay, Four of Cups. Um, they're not satisfied in that relationship connection. Okay, it's a lot of stagnant energy. Um, this person could be waiting for you to come back around. Some of you, maybe you haven't talked to this person for like, I'm picking up on like three to five days, three to five weeks, three to five months, three to five years for some of you. Okay. So, um, September could be significant. February, March, um, August or October could be significant. Okay. Uh, but yeah, I feel like this person may be acting like they're all happy. They're all good. You know, their life is like whatever. Right. But it's not. There's a, there's a lot of boredom here. This person's not satisfied in the relationship. I will say this person may also be drinking more than often or drinking more than usual. Tell me about the actions, though. Actions this person plans on taking. For some of you, this person could be at a distance or they moved. They could have moved or they could have lived live at a distance or something like that. 
actions this person plans on taking towards Gemini, November 2023. Queen of Pentacles, some of you could be connecting with a Virgo, Capricorn, Taurus, another Gemini. Ace of Swords and the Moon. So I feel like this person, um, they are missing you a lot. They are thinking about you a lot. They're keeping this a secret, but their karmic knows. If they're with somebody else, this person already knows. They could be dealing with a Pisces. Okay, Pisces. Um, picking up on heavy Capricorn, Virgo, Gemini, Sagittarius. Okay, it could be any sign. This person, um, you know, there could be kids involved, but this person is keeping this secret that they desire you, that they miss you, that they're nostalgic, that they want you. Um, I feel like this person, you know, they could have blocked you. They could have cut you off very impulsively, Gemini. And maybe they didn't even give you an explanation. That's what I'm picking up on. But I feel like low-key they are manifesting you back. As far as communication, though, I'm not very, I'm not really seeing that, okay? This person could be very much focused on their work, okay, their finances. Will there be communication? between Gemini and this person, November 2023. Give me one more card. A, uh, Page of Swords. No, a lot of stalking though. This person does stalk you a lot, Gemini. They try to find information about you. This person could be younger than you, does not have to be okay, but they try to find information about you. They stalk you. For some of you, like, this, you gave this person some type of jewelry, they still wear it, okay, Spirit is saying. Something about a jewelry you gave this person, they still wear it, or some type of accessory, okay? Um, will this person ever communicate with Gemini in the future, in the near future? I just Holy Spirit, will they ever communicate Gemini and their love interest? The star card, they're very hopeful that you two will communicate or reunite sometime. I feel like this has a lot to do with destiny. When the timing is right, when the moment is right, when the universe is like, okay, it's time. There will be, um, I'm hearing confrontation or there will be some type of unexpected event that occurs between you two. One more. Yeah, death card wanted to show its, um, its face. Um... Yeah, in the near future, there, it, there will be a chance for a new beginning or a transformation in the connection or a new beginning or a new phase between you two. But I feel like that's not going to happen until like they're telling me, oh man, spring, something about spring, okay? But yeah, I feel like maybe someone still is learning some type of karmic lesson. And until that lesson is not learned, I, I don't know, I feel like you two... Um, I feel like this person is still going to be kind of stagnant. Okay, Gemini. Let's go ahead and see what's coming for singles. Gemini singles. Gemini singles. Can I just Holy Spirit? Gemini singles. Gemini singles. The hangman. Pisces energy. The Wheel of Fortune again, Ten of Pentacles. I love that. Okay. I know this is a love reading, but I will say some of you will unexpected, unexpectedly be receiving a high, either a high raise, a new position, a lot of money here, a lot of money, Ten of Pentacles, um, some type of stability, inheritance, okay, or purchase of a home, purchase of land for some of you. Um, you could also be receiving like inheritance from a like a older man, okay. Something about an older man, grandpa or something, or dad. Um, now, I will say that some of you will be unexpectedly meeting the person that you will end up marrying, okay? That you will end up having a long-term relationship with. Tell me more about this. Gemini singles. Eight of cups. Nine of swords. Okay, make sure that you are... Here's the thing, okay? Some of you are walking away from the negativity. Some of you are walking away from... Um, toxic energies, toxic people. Some of you are literally letting go of your own negative thoughts, okay, in the month of November and getting better rest. Uh, some of you could be wanting to go near water, take some type of vacation. Some of you really like dolphins, all right? Um, I do see new love here for you, okay, Gemini? I see new love, and I feel like it's going to happen very unexpectedly. Um, tell me more about this Eight of Ace of Cups for Gemini, November 2023. 
yeah, the world card. Some of you, it's going to be very, very unexpected. Um, it's definitely going to be a new phase in your life. Could be involving travels, or this person could live at a distance or from a different culture. Queen of uh, King of Cups, strong Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio. Here, this person could have water in their chart. Okay, you have the Knight of Swords. What is this about? And okay, some another air sign around your energy could be a Gemini, Libra, Aquarius is receiving karma for something that they did to you. Okay, could be another air sign. Um, good, uh, important information could also be like. Never mind. Okay, um, messages are coming in really quick here. Uh, four of Wands, some of you could be purchasing a home or just going through a lot of celebrations, parties, gatherings in the month of November. Um, tell me more about the Ace of Cups. Two of Wands, some of you will be unexpectedly traveling or moving or something like that, and I feel like that's where you're going to meet your new love. Or this person, again, could live at a distance, or there might be... Um, two to four age difference. 10 years for some of you or yeah they could be from a different culture okay but yeah i do see you growing with this you do have the 10 of cups and the 10 of pentacles so that is truly amazing okay you do have a beautiful uh love coming in here for you gemini okay very unexpectedly too But all right, Gemini, that's what I have for you. If this did not resonate, you're more than welcome to check your other placements. Thank you to all my loyal subscribers who continue to love and support my channel. And if you haven't already, please like, comment, share, subscribe, hit that notification bell, and I'll talk to you soon. Bye-bye.